Hello guys and welcome to Kingdom Come Deliverance. This is part number 16 and we're about to go to the nest of vipers to look at this camp, get some recon, perhaps even some sabotage. Who knows? Uh, we got some uh, Timmy directions. They didn't sound that clear. Uh, it's currently very dark. I can't really see where I'm going right now. But it should be, uh, should be daylight soon. Yeah, it's currently 4am. The sun will shine in a matter of minutes. I promise you that. Well, right, hopefully we're going the right way first. So we have to get to this first location, and then Timmy, we follow Timmy's instructions. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I've got a really bad feeling about this. Oh, okay. Go on the north road. This road here. Uh, go to the fork with the ruined cabin. Okay, so this is still the north road, isn't it? I hope. <laughs> uh, so just keep going this way. I sort of, yeah, no, it didn't, really, didn't really give me that, that sort of clear instruction, but we're still going north. I'm not sure if being on horseback is wise. It's still dark, great. I'm hoping for another instruction very soon. Either that or we've gone the wrong way. Which might be the case. I guess I'm not very good at following instructions. Oh. Stop right there. Give me all you've got. Go make left and continue. Glass. I'll be honest, I'm just winging it right now. That's completely threw me off. It was dark. I can't really see who they were. But they seemed fairly aggressive. Interesting sight. I've just gone past. I'm going to have to hope this is the right way. I'm thinking this is now the right way. Been a little bit distracted. I must be honest, the, the, the fact I can't see much. I couldn't see much. It was really dark at first. Did not help. Who is that guy? Is he friendly? I would imagine probably not. Oh. Who's this guy? He oh, it's a trader. All right. Uh, Excuse me. May I ask you for your help? So just, go on, just, just keep going straight. All right. Keep going straight. This is the crossroad. I need direction. Just keep going straight. Excuse me. No, Could I'm busy right me? now. Nope, I can't. <laughs> I'm busy, okay? I said go straight. That is what we're doing. Just gotta keep on going. So we're heading like a sort of west direction right now. While we're in the forest. Alright, this looks like a footpath. Are we close? I mean we are following Timmy's instructions, not very well. And the instructions were probably bad anyway, so honestly, I have no idea where we are right now. We could be anywhere. It's just crazy how big this map is. Oh, <gasps> we found it. This might be it. Guys, I think we found it. What's the hell? Right, Sabotard, you can poison their food. Hey, you know, sort. What? Has someone seen me already? What? I honestly have no idea. Ooh. What I'm tempted to do though, because we're quite noisy at the moment. Also, I do have a new helmet. Um, is take our armor off, which I know sounds a little bit insane, but we need to be sneaky. So if I can get all this armor off, be like a naked man, and then try and sneak in. I know it sounds like a really, really bad idea, but bear with me, look. Zero noise. No noise at all. Yes. Sneaky sneakers. Try and get into this camp. Mate, it would take a while to get across, and there's nowhere to shelter from arrows. It's like nothing, man. There we go. It wasn't hard, was it? Jesus. What's the camp? I feel like I'm lost already. Well, it's like up here out of nowhere. 
Is it over here? Yeah, the camera's here. Okay, good. I was going to say, like, where are we? <laughs> like, we're making zero noise right now. So we can be ultimate stealth. Will anyone see us? There's the camp. A stockade. A handful of men could hold it for quite a while. That's some useful knowledge. How can we get in here? Is there a way to get in? Go back to Sir Radzig. So apparently that's enough info to do the attack. But I do want to try and poison their food. Right guys, it's time to sneak into their camp and I am pooping myself. Poopy, 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 poopy. That's all I'm gonna say. Can I see anyone? Is anyone there? Can anyone see me? All right, start a lock pick and hope no one hears me. If I screw up this once, I think I'm just gonna get seen. They're gonna hear me. Let's start there. Try and loop around. This is a pretty tricky little spot, this one. Oh. Done it. Oh, that's close, that one. Woo! Right. Oh, we have some armor. Yes! Right. Put it straight on. Straight on. I'm hoping they won't spot me and spot the fact I can't speak Hungarian. I need to get rid of some of my arm because I'm a little bit heavy right now. Uh, also, unequip my sword, unequip my arrows and my bow. There you go. That works. I lost one piece of armor. Uh, we're now disguised. So we try and poison their food, get some details about their camp. Uh, also set the fire, that, sorry, the arrows on fire. <coughs> that is the goal, my friends. What's that? Oh, poison. Sweet! That's exactly what I need. Right, I'll be honest. I feel like we have to. They're not killing us, which is a good thing. <laughs> right, to poison that food just there without anyone seeing me. Look at that. Those heathens are a lot tidier than the bandits. I'll try and drop it in for some seeds. The secret is in the spices. Oh no. Set these quickly alive. I'd like to see you try shooting these now. Let's try and run out the front for the camp. I'd like to see you try right, shooting these Go, go, go. Let's leave. They may... We alright? Good ground for a big fight. Honor in combat. Much cover. Shit. We're in combat officially. I'll be, I'll be running for a while already. My stamina is low. If I, if I can call for my horse. A bridge. A bridge, yes. That'll make it easier to cross the Oh, shit, what was that? Open ground on both Someone just shoot there, me? But it's the fastest route for an attack. Oh, shit, 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 shit. I have to try and call for my horse and then just run. Let's find a little bit of space first. Just keep running, man. Just keep running. Right, is my horse behind me? Yes. Get in the horse, get in the horse, get in the horse. Go, go, go. Speed, horsey. Yes! We've escaped! We've done it! Oh, that guy looked at... Was it the, the food, wasn't it? And he looked like he was going to spot me. I was like, okay, let's just speed this up. Let's just get out of here. And that is what I did. I ran. I ran so quick. Yeah, also my foot is injured. So we need to... Have a little snooze. Try and fix it. It's actually bleeding, actually. I might need a bandage. This would be the first time I've ever done that. Can I use it? Oh, you're not bleeding. Okay, so just like a damaged foot. All right. I didn't know that. Sorry. So, Redzik, I have info. I've been in severe trouble. I sneaked actually into the camp naked. <laughs> it sounds it sounds like a crazy plan, but it worked. I don't know how it worked, but it did. And I followed these very shockingly bad instructions. Where is he? Radzig, where are you? Gotta be around here somewhere. Is that him there? He's going for a sleep! What are you doing? Wake up! Get up. I'm here! Greetings. What do you need? What do you what do I need? I come back from the scouting. I'm back from scouting, sir. Excellent. What have you found out? 
I found out my helmet looks really bad. I mean, I wanted a better helmet that didn't really cover my face too much. So that's 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 why I picked that helmet. Yeah. Uh, it's in some overgrown ruins. There's an overgrown ruined village in the woods where they're dug in. That sounds like Pribislavitz. He used to belong to Sir Divish before Havel Maddock attacked and torched it, and then imprisoned Divish. It's been left abandoned ever since. I was hoping they wouldn't be so organized. Earthworks and fortifications. That's quite a different matter from writing some rabble out of the woods. It's deafening indeed. I tried to count them. I tried to count them. And how many of them are there? A Bear in mind I'm relying on what you say. Few. We'll have to call for reinforcements, and that's no simple matter. Every man that comes with us will be lacking somewhere else. And I don't want bandits pillaging some other town because there's no one left to mount a defence. Um, hardly worth mentioning. There's a lot of them. I say quite a few, not too many. A fair amount. There's quite a few of them there. Perdition. We'll definitely need reinforcements. I think the Talmberg men should suffice. I don't like leaving the castle unprotected, but there's no other option. Yeah, that does kind of suck. They could, they could do a counter, which is a worry. Um, there's humans in there. There aren't just bandits in the camp. There are humans too. Quite a few of them. Humans, you say? Where the hell did they come from? Could Sigismund have left them there after he raised Scalitz? This is looking more and more serious. It's not looking great, is it? It's mostly bandits in the camp. They're not villagers with pitchforks, but not regular soldiers either. <laughs> no more than I expected. I have no fear of them. But underestimating the enemy can be fatal. That helmet looks so shiny. Oh, so new. There's arms and armour. I took a look at their arms and armour. They're not a proper army, but they're equipped quite well. What about archers? Um, Did we see... I didn't see any, but there's definitely some about. There's a few of them, and they're positioned well. If we charge them head on, they'll probably do us a lot of damage. I don't like the sound of that. It complicates the situation. Dealing with them before the battle would be the best option. Uh, they're making some ladders in the camp. They're up to something in the middle of the camp. It looked like they were making several long ladders. Ladders? That sounds like they're planning a siege. I like this less and less. On the other hand, we can use that to our advantage. If we can capture those ladders, we can use them to scale their own fortifications. Fair point. That's about all I saw, sir. I didn't notice anything else. That's all right. Did you manage any sabotage while I you did. were there, as I asked you? I did it and then ran. <laughs> I managed to destroy some of their arrow supplies, so they'll have less ammunition. Well done. That's just what we need. Good. I managed to slip poison to a few of them. They should be too sick to fight. You're as cunning as a fox. We need more like you. That's all, sir. Don't worry, Henry. You've proven yourself an excellent Yay. spy. Yay! I need you to go to Sir Divish in Talmberg and tell him to send Captain Robard and his men to our aid. There's not enough of us here in the camp. You can rely on me, sir. What yes, should sir. I tell him? Tell him to take all his men. Leave only the bare minimum at the castle and march to Pribislavitz. I'll take everyone but for one or two sentries. Hopefully together we'll have enough men to defeat them. All right, I'll get going. And be quick. We've no time to spare. God be with you. So it must be quick. Can I not sleep then? Because my, my injury is a little bit annoying. I would like to sleep. Just a, just, just a tiny bit, please. Should I sleep? I don't know. I'm going to sleep. I'm going to sleep. This could be a risk. We need to heal up. That will do. A couple of hours. Three hours is fine. So I want my energy to go up. I want my health to go back up. So we are ready for the battle. Yes. I'm actually quite looking forward to this because obviously we just ran away. Scared. Now we're going to come back with a force behind us. And we will attack. We will. Can't wait. So I said do it in a rush. And I decided to sleep on the floor. But I need, I need, to, I need to be fully healed up. Uh, yeah, I know, that could be a bad call, I guess. Hopefully not. So Divish, I am coming for you, sir. We're not even fully healed, but 
That will do. Sir Divish, I need your help. Please send... Oh. Sabotage the bandits before the battle begins. What? What is going on right now? I don't know what's going on. What happened? Did that take too long? Sabotage, I've done that. I think we're... I think we're doing okay. I don't know. Weird. Hopefully the quest isn't screwed up. I mean, I slept for a couple of hours, but I had to heal up a little bit. That was a hard mission. It wasn't easy. Henry, I'm glad you came. Hello. Sir Divish. Sir Divish. We must speak. Where is he? Is that him? Yes, there he is. We need reinforcements. Greetings. What do you need? Oh, he's not even going to turn around. Give me some respect. Sir Radzik sent me with an important message. He asked for reinforcements. He needs more men? What's going on? The bandits and Cumans have set up camp in Pribislavitz. They're preparing for something. Sir Radzig wants to mount an assault on them, but he doesn't have enough men. Hang on. Easy now. From the beginning. What happened? I managed to track down the camp of the bandits who raided Neuhof. But it's not just a gang of brigands. More like a small army in a fortified encampment. I don't know what they're up to. But I'm sure they're getting ready for something, and Sir Radzig wants to destroy them before they get a chance. So it's worse than I thought. But Sir Radzig is right. We should do something about them before it's too late. I'll send my soldiers. Sir Radzig said to take all your men and leave only a minimum guard at the castle. What? Everyone? There really are a lot of them, Sir Divish. He's leaving the camp almost empty, too. We're to go and join his people in Pribislavitz and mount an assault together. All right then. Sir Radzig knows what he's doing. I'll muster the men and send them with Captain Robard in command. Would you lead my men there right now? Uh, yes. Go yes, for sir. it. May God be with you in battle. Sir Radzig. I'm glad to see you, Captain Robard. I hope Henry's explained everything to you. He did, but I find it hard to believe. Who could possibly put together such a significant military force, and right under our noses? We'll just have to find out, but I don't think we will until after a battle. If we don't deal with them now, who knows what they'll be capable of in a week or two. I agree entirely, my lord. What's the plan? Right, lad. We're almost at the place you described. Now we'll have to advance cautiously. I need you to tell me how it looks around the camp, so I can decide which side to lead the attack from. Sir, that's a big responsibility. I don't think I should... I asked you a question, boy. You've been there and seen everything, so speak up. There are three ways to get in. Directly along the straight path to the camp, the long way round through the woods and over an old weir, or by a narrow bridge over a deep ditch. Let's start with the direct route. That sounds like the easiest approach. How does it look there? That path leads round their battlements. It's fortified and patrolled. The chances are they'd shower us with arrows on the way. It's a good thing you're here, Henry. We'll have to try another way, then. What about the approach through the woods and the weir? I don't like the idea of marching such a long way over rough ground, but if it's the better option... It's a long way through the woods, and there are patrols there as well. They'll call the alarm before we reach the camp. I thought so. What about the last approach, over the bridge? It's a bit narrow for my liking. It's narrow, all right. But once we get over, we can quickly occupy the best ground for a battle. We only have to take down a few archers. The battleground sounds inviting, but that bridge and the archers... It's not an easy decision. Each option has its pros and cons. Well, I try to answer to the best of my ability, sir. And you'll be suitably rewarded for your efforts. From what you say, the route over the bridge is the best option. If we're fast, we'll have the advantage. With the help of God, we'll win this day. We shall win this day. We now lead into a big battle. Baptism of Fire. Oh, I like the sound of this one. Well, Alright, we're going to pause there. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Sorry, a little bit of a tease there. Uh, but the next mission is going to be a good one. I can't wait. Bye-bye.